Today we're on Pilanga Reserve, which is in central west Queensland. Pilanga is a newly changed name after we've had our native title determination and Wonkamudla people wanted to recognise where uh, the former Cravens Peak Reserve homestead was and so uh, we've changed it back to the name of the, the spring that exists there and that spring is named Pilanga. To come home is that decompression. Um, as soon as I come up from that turn off at the Georgina River crossing, I know I'm home, I'm back on country. And I can feel my spirit lifting. I can feel a weight lifted. My energy is restored when I'm here. I'm a lot calmer and um, just that sense of self and belonging and not having to question where do I come from because I know I come from here. This place is so special because this is where my mother lived, where my grandparents lived, where their grandparents lived. They've been walking these sand dunes for many, many generations. So it's been, it's been a really long journey with working with Bush Heritage and um, it was around 2009 when we first really started to sit down and talk with one another. Um, communication is just so important um, to ensure that this country is preserved for forever. Um, and that has developed over the years, I've been involved in the Aboriginal Engagement Committee and, and now sit on the Board of Directors for Bush Heritage Australia. So it not only uh, recognition of my cultural knowledge, um, but also uh, having that opportunity to actually have a meaningful participation at a senior level in an organisation shows that recognition that Aboriginal people are valued and that's really important, particularly for the work that Bush Heritage does uh, in protecting and keeping healthy landscapes. And the arid zone where we are today is no different. As Wonkamudla people, looking after country is, is just so important because healthy country, healthy people. <laughs> 